Egyptian Senator Ray. Thank you, Madam President. I seldom get up to talk about this, and especially during this session when I know that most of our votes are very politically driven. But I feel compelled to do this because I have been reviewing a lot of the decisions that we've made about children in the last few days, and they are very relevant to this amendment that is being proposed by Senator Stephen. And what the majority members are telling us right now is that this is about low-income children, about minority children. And I am just shocked to hear this. Members, I want to remind you that during the last few days, we got all the funding for Indian Child Welfare Act, which is given to the lowest income Indian children in the state of Minnesota who are placed out of their homes. We also cancel all of the funding for youth summer programs in the lowest income communities in the state of Minnesota. We cut compensatory funding for the three largest districts in the state of Minnesota where we have the highest concentration of poverty. We also cut integration which allows predominantly low income children of color to attend out schools outside of Minneapolis and St. Paul. We also cut all the funding for caregiver support that provides funding for grandparents who take care of the children that are placed in out-of-home placement. All of these funding members was for poor children, and you just cut this funding. You just did that. So do not come today to tell us that you want to provide public funding to private schools to support low-income children of color, because that is just not true. What you are doing is taking public dollars to go to private schools because you want to dismantle, to dismantle public education. That's what you want to do. Just don't lie about it. Further discussion, Senator Ortman. Madam President, I would just ask Senator Torres Ray not to make personal attacks to members in this chamber or to challenge our motivations. They are good and sound. I think members have spoken passionately in support of this, and she should not be allowed to question that here in this chamber. Thank you, Senator Ortman. Senator Torres Ray. Madam Chair, I am not talking, Madam President, I am not talking about motivation. I am talking about facts. I'm talking about decisions that were made in this body during the last few days. This is not motivation, this is not ideals, these are decisions that you already made. 